contractions that are close apart like close together that I can feel um but I'm not like ready to go to the hospital just yet so I just wanted you to know so you're not getting woke up last minute I texted Amanda so she knows if you are experiencing a medical emergency please call 911 immediately our office is currently closed and someone will return your call on the next business day. Good morning. Thank you for calling. Your call will be answered by the first available operator. Spell your first name, please. A-L-Y-S-S-A. -S -S and your how many weeks? 39. Thank you. I'll get that right out. If you don't hear from the doctor in 20 minutes, give us a call back. We'll try again. If you decide you can't wait, you can go to your delivery hospital. Okay, perfect. Thank you. Hello? Hi, Alyssa, this is Hi, good, good. Um, they're not like painful, but they're definitely like contractions. And then when I went pee, there was some blood, like a small little, I, I don't know if I would consider it a clot, um, but there was like something, like it was like a, it was like a chunk of blood, like small, very small. And then when I wiped, there was like a decent amount. I just don't know, like I don't, I don't want to go in and then it's like not active and then they like want to break my water. If you're doing okay, I mean as long as your water's not broken. Yeah. It sounds like you can you can just kind of watch it or monitor it. Perfect. And if you know and if it continues, certainly if it'll get too heavy or uncomfortable, yeah. you'll know, let go in. 
But otherwise, you know, if um, if we get into the day and you're not sure, I can always check in the office again too. Okay. Like wait till the contractions maybe get more intense where I'm like kind of like out of breath and stuff like that. Yeah. I think that's perfectly reasonable. I really do. Okay. Or, you know, if, you, if the bleeding, if you get much bleeding that would be continuous or certainly if you think your water breaks. Okay. Those are probably good reasons to say, you're welcome. Thank you. All right. Bye-bye. So he's not too concerned. So I'm not too concerned. Grant's still sleeping, um, but I just went to the bathroom and there was kind of a decent amount more blood come out. So honestly, it makes me a little bit nervous I'm having a contraction right now. They are getting closer and stronger, so it doesn't hurt to go in. I'm just definitely not like and a ton of pain so I don't figure I'm very far progressed it's just the blood amount that's kind of I'm not sure if I'm gonna leave right when Amanda gets here or not but at least she's here so Amanda is here the contractions are coming and going obviously and I'm gonna pop an applesauce the blood is still staying um, I never even showed this but I got two baskets for the nurses and Grant's putting the stuff in the car. Um, they're very manageable. It's four o'clock now. Um, but I'm kind of just worrying about the blood, but I'm also assuming it's probably normal for some people too, I don't know. But we're gonna go in and get checked out just to make sure my water has not broke yet, so I do need to probably get a, or a trash bag or something to lie in the car. They're coming like close, but they're not like lasting long. Yeah. Right. Yeah, but in the morning, just give them like that milk and that sippy cup. Just regular in there. Okay. Yeah, and then you could do either of those two options. So clean, jeez. She knew. <laughs> Wonder what's ahead of me. Oh no. <laughs> He could come today, you never know. I bet he will. I would be extremely shocked if, if he didn't come today. Yeah, that's what I think too. But uh, when I was talking to Maddie, she's like, I never had any blood at all. Like, I would definitely call. Because, like, it wasn't just, like, spotting. Like, it's, like, a decent amount. Like, there's, like, a little, like, clot the in, in first yeah. time. And then I called, and he's like, I'm not too concerned about it. But if you are, then you definitely come in. And I was like, if it's that one time I'm not and my contractions are enough to want to go in and I don't want to go in and then they're like, well, you're already here. Do you want us to break your water? I want my water to break on its own and just, okay. I don't know. Cause when your water breaks, it pain intensifies like this. Headed off to the hospital now. I really wanted my water to break at home. I just hope it breaks on its own. I'm getting another contraction now. I did want to labor longer at home, but oh well. I just hope the blood is fine. I think it's gonna be.
It's so weird when you come out of a contraction. It's just like nothing. I was going to be wheeled in a wheelchair. Seven, eight centimeters. Shocked. Um, 80% in face. She said 80 to 90, but she's going to go 80. Um, negative, or minus, what's Kelsey say? Minus, minus one. one station. Um, my best friend that is an OB nurse, she is literally on vacation, and today is her last day of vacation. And I literally said, what would you do if I, my water breaks on Friday? So that basically happened. My preferred favorite doctor ever of life that I've always been talking about. Is gonna deliver. Um, I feel literally so good. I don't know what I am now. And then, yeah, I have penicillin because of group B strep positive, but they don't think that I'm gonna be able to get both doses in because I'm so far along and progressed in active labor and a contraction. Coming out. one more thing I feel great <laughs> oh like a lot of blood like bloody show like a, a lot of bloody show but it's normal and then, what? I up all night. huh I don't know how you're still like, how would be yeah and I slept it off because I, I get to meet my baby I was so sweaty and I heard you walking around all night you did hear me I feel like I got run over by a Mack truck 
just broke. I literally almost got on the camera. Yeah. Oh, now they're gonna come on. Nelly. When they had me doing the last contraction on my right side to bring me to a full 10, it all hit me. All the emotions just fled finally and um, just that it's not Weston anymore. I knew I was going to start pushing and I just started crying just full of emotion and I just told Grant like it's not going to be Weston anymore. <clears throat> that was just such a sweet moment. <clears throat> memory to have um and the nurse I was like I'm sorry I'm just so emotional like it's not Weston anymore and she's like you're fine like it, this is a big deal cry it out <laughs> I loved my nurse okay I'm gonna hand this to you I'm gonna put a new chuck so that way you're not kneeling and oh yeah. water <laughs> On my water. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Jets pee. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's funny. Great. Yeah. And then I'm gonna just spray 
is this uh, that way you can kind of lean over. Oh, I'm getting a contraction. Oh. Yep, you can do it. Concentrate. Come on. Here it comes. 
push. Here it comes. Alyssa, you gotta push them out. You got it, sweetie. All in your bottom. Come on, you got it. Good job. Can I? Okay, okay, listen to me. Yeah. Take a deep breath in. Hold it and push. push. Go. Two, right here. three, four, five, yep. six, yep. seven, eight, babe. nine, ten. Blow it away. Good Another job. one for me. Ready? One more. Sweetie. Push. There you go. go. You got it. Okay, now blow. Blow. Blow, blow. Breathe. <laughs> Breathe. <laughs> oh, is everything out? Yeah. A little push. A little push. There. Okay, now, now blow. Now breathe. <laughs> Pull your baby out. Yeah. There you go. There you go. Good job. Good job, Alyssa. You did. Good job. You sure did. You are a great Hi, pusher. buddy. Happy birthday. Happy birthday. You can make a baby, sweetheart. Is he okay? He's tiny. Yeah. He's a tiny boy. <laughs> Did I tear? Just a little bit. Okay. Did you have a tear or anything? A second time? degree? Yeah, this looks like it's going to be just the first. Okay. And it's yeah. probably right in the same area. Okay. You're going to feel pressure right now. Here's your pussy. There we go. Yay. There. Pretty cool work. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. Yeah, so this is the side that is just attached oh, to your uterus. I, love that. I always oh, think okay. this is interesting. So yeah, here, no, I love there's the cord, and there's the sack that oh, the baby he was in. Oh, he was in. You were in so that. Oh, my God. Yeah. Oh, 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 oh. That is so cool. <laughs> That's your music. Oh, we didn't hear it last <laughs> <night>. <laughs> 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 Let me tuck them in for you. 
Yeah. Oh, look at that face. It's gonna snap. cheap one so I have to take an expensive one husband's allowed to come in now. That was the size of baby at five weeks. That's the size of baby now. It's so hard to see because I'm so early. Like it literally is a blob. Yay, yay, he said yay mama. Hooray, I can't wait to have a playmate. I can't wait. You already know your name. Did your boy or girl, but Baby is half an inch, that's the heartbeat. 12 weeks pregnant. Are you? Yeah. Are you really? <laughs> no. Oh, really? Really? Uh -huh. I'm like pregnant in my postpartum phase. We're at Kelsey's house. And we're gonna tell them the gender. Hello. 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 Hello.
<laughs> I think it's mine. Okay, gotta read them together out loud. Oh my god, are you serious? <laughs> are you serious? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. <laughs> It's so it's a boy? Yeah! <laughs> I knew it! A little brother. It reminds me of like how much I love my baby or something in Hide of the Sky. Jet? Dude, Jet? Did you see? Did you know the Abby, did you see that? I knew the name. First time it scared the crap out of me and I wanted to just start crying like I hope my baby's okay. I hope my baby's okay. I can't wait to see our little baby and have that anatomy scan. Be in the moment. Um, it goes by so 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 fast. Those first trimesters, you'll you'll never get that first trimester back. This will be my last pregnancy. Give him a little sibling. Our family will be complete. My little brother. I am day 140, loving my body and just really like looking in the mirror and like really soaking in the visual that I am seeing because that will go away. My belly. Perfectly, oh, so big and beautiful. Belly, right now. I'm so excited. Face. Getting actually to see the uh, femur and all the different bones was pretty cool. I can feel like parts of his body. I am 24 weeks pregnant. I am currently 27 weeks pregnant. I am 30 weeks pregnant. Today is a gestational diabetes glucose test day. Oh, I get to see my freaking favorite doctor. Ah, I'm so excited. Blood work done. I'm so tired. I was doing some birth affirmations. I've been doing more affirmations and pregnancy meditations and just preparing myself for labor, um, my mind for labor. Ugh, I just love this thing. I love you in there, boy. Literally, a boy is my dream. I've only ever, 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 ever wanted boys. We're having two boys. Quite a bit of hair. I mean, okay. when, when he's born, you'll definitely see hair. How crazy to find a five pound baby inside me. Our bodies literally are beautiful and know exactly what they're doing it's just crazy to me rose that like has bloomed so since i've had a baby before like the cervix kind of like opens up and then after a baby it kind of comes back down you've got this like don't don't like uh, sorry you gotta do this when you're pregnant every time labor and delivery is like my like Specialty, like my number one love ever in the world. I don't really know what to expect, so I'm not gonna act like I know what being a mom of two is because I have no idea. Crazy still to imagine like Weston holding a baby. Weston and Jet. Yeah, we do. Jet's life hasn't really missed out on anything because it's gonna all be included in like Weston's life, you know? Like Weston was only seven months old when we were pregnant. <laughs> you wanna feel your baby brother? I look like a big old egg. Now it's big egg city. Like they say like chiropractor work can like help. My mucus plug did come out last night. It's so weird because I thought I was going to till due date and I'm having like all these symptoms that I think like when am I going but there's the valley. I'm like emotional, it's just hitting me and I knew this would happen. I'm sure it'll happen like a lot from now to birth and I'm so lucky and like feel honored and blessed to raise these boys into this world and like deal with that and like work through it and learn from them as little babies. We're, we've learned, I've learned so much from this little guy in my belly and this little guy that's sleeping right now in his crib. You gonna meet your little brother in June? Yeah. I'm 39 weeks tomorrow, so I'm 38 in six days. Um, but I did have progression to so my dilation. I'm a three centimeters right now and I'm so excited for labor. It's gonna be so beautiful. I'm so excited to be in control of my body like that again. Like it's something that you just never experience. Like I'm never gonna experience that again in my life and it's just so beautiful. <laughs> 